All right. And number three in lesson two in chapter five is on sequences. And of course, it's getting a little bit harder. We're going to be using a table and a word problem. So let's pull out the math. So let's do this. And it's three. And it says the greeting cards that Meredith makes are sold in boxes at a gift store. The first week, the store sold five boxes. And the book is uh, showing you the first week. This is weeks and they sold five boxes. So the first week they sold five boxes, so it'd be one, the first week times five would be five. Each week the, the store sells five more boxes. So each week they sell two times five, three times five, and so on. What algebraic expression can be used to find the total number of boxes sold at the end of 100 week? What is the total? All right, so we're going to be using this. So we know that there's each week they're selling five boxes. And every week from there, they're going to add another five boxes. Um, so let's look at this here with the, t uh, the table. So the first week they sell, first week one times five, they sold five boxes. This is the value. Okay, the second week they sold two times five, because, uh, and that would be 10. And the third week is three times five, that would be 15. So in the third week they sold 15 boxes. And that's what that means. Well, in the nth term, so all t n t weeks, we would still say n times five, and that would be five times n, which is five n. So it would be one times five, two times five, three times five, and n times five. We'll go over this a little bit in the classroom. Uh, so it would be five n. So the question is, uh, on the hundredth week. So if this is the pattern, uh, so five n, n meaning um, the number of weeks. Um, let's look at that. Instead of five, uh, n here, we're going to substitute because n equals 100. So it'd be 5 times 100. At the end of, uh, uh, oh, of 100th week, at the end of the 100th week, sorry about that, there would be 500 boxes sold. So, and we got to label it because it's a word problem. And so she will be selling 500 at the end of 100. And so you've answered both questions. Um, find the total number of boxes sold at the end, of, the end of the 100th week. And what is the total? It is 500 boxes. We'll go over this in class if you have any problems. Thank you.